hello. We are going to show you in this tutorial how to do the project called Multiple Me. So you will start off with a basic uh, background, um, 8 by 10 by 300 resolution, and you will need um, a picture of yourself in the same location. Try to keep the camera still when you're taking it, and you will select each image and then paste it onto the blank background and you don't have to manipulate the size you can just place it on there and do the same click control um, A to select it, control C to copy um, and then uh, control V to paste then you will do that for the same with the third picture control A, control C to copy Control V to paste, and you will just need to make sure they're all in their own each layer. You will go up to um, select, select all layers, then you will go to edit, auto align layers. Make sure it's on auto to align them. Click OK, and the size may be a little off on the side, but we can take care of that after. Then you will need to do a layer mask for the second one and the third one. The first one will be the background and to um, you will need to create the layer mask and make it white black so then you click the paint bucket select your color click on the background and you will do the same to the second one. So as you see it is on this one so just remember what Per, what person is in each layer, grab your brush tool, um, make it fit the size that you want, and then just start painting over and add yourself from the other picture. Um, it doesn't need to be perfect but because it's all aligned, so the background will be the same. Just make sure to keep the shadow to make it look realistic and keep that in the image. Then after you're done with that, you go to the third one, where the third person would be. Keep the shadow as well. And then you are, then you will select all layers again. So select all layers. And you will click control E to make them all as one. Then you will click uh, control T and just um, hit the space bar and make the image bigger to fit the white in the background. And just align it the way you like. You can even play with the saturation or the tones of the picture to make it fit your, your likes, but that would be it. Thank you.